Good evening, I'm Shamika Neely. Bloomington police responded to a call on Tuesday night that left one man dead. The fatal shooting occurred in Crestmount Apartments following a domestic dispute. 26-year-old Vincent Jackson died early this morning after being shot in the head. A woman, 53-year-old Klansit Cox, was arrested on initial charges of voluntary manslaughter. Schools back in session in Bloomington, Monroe County Community School Corporation students and teachers began the new school year on a positive note today in spite of the lingering concerns over teacher layoffs and an uncertain budgetary future. Highland Park Elementary School principal Jan Williamson says her biggest worry this year is the loss of three teachers. It is going to be a challenge as far as classroom management because for example as I speak to you right now on paper I have two first grade classes with 29 children in them. We've never experienced anything like that here at Highland Park. Williamson says the school is taking steps to help teachers deal with the additional workload. Stacy Pace, a special education teacher at Highland Park Elementary, says many of her fellow educators worked closely to the summer fundraising drive, which provided money to restore extracurricular stipends lost to a recent round of state funding cuts. A lot of my colleagues and friends were rift or have experienced some sort of cut within their position and we're definitely going to feel the ramifications of that through class sizes. This is the first time in recent years that the MCCSC has not been able to restore all of the teaching positions lost at the end of the last school year. According to Assistant Superintendent for Human Resources and Personnel Peggy Chambers, the district is starting the semester with about 70 fewer teachers than last year. 26 of those positions come from elementary school classrooms. And to look at your weather tonight, partly cloudy, lows in the lower 60s. Tomorrow, mostly sunny, highs in the upper 80s. Tomorrow night, partly cloudy, lows in the mid 60s. And taking a look at your five-day forecast on Friday, partly cloudy with a 40% chance of thunderstorms. Highs in the upper 80s, lows in the upper 60s. And on Saturday, partly cloudy with a 40% chance of thunderstorms.